Hey y'all, this is your girl Jamie here. What is going on? What is up, J Squad? I hope y'all are having a truly wonderful day today. If you guys haven't already hit that like button, make sure you do so. And if you are new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Today I'm going to do a different type of video. Um, I couldn't sleep last night and just kind of came up with this, <laughs> this idea. But I've been thinking about it. So it's definitely going to be a more visual. You're going to have to try to visualize this video a little bit more. But... If you can't visualize it, no worries. I've already worked out some of the visualizations for y'all. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and just jump right on into this video today. We're going to be talking about Kim Kardashian. Picture it. Kim Kardashian. Calabasas. 2025. Yes, we're only talking about maybe a year and a half out from now. But picture it, Kim Kardashian broke. No one even knows her name or that she had even existed at this point. She's going to be one of us. She's struggling to pay her bills. Financially, she's going to be strapped. She's not going to have any ways of making money. She has... Zero skills to fall back on, no education. She can't even read and write. The only thing that Kim at this point will be able to do is do what she does best. And what is that, you guys ask? Hmm, she lays on her back and she's a doorknob. But even then, by this point, she's already gained a lot of weight, y'all. She's already starting to age out in the face because all the money she had for plastic surgeries, she has no more. So, what is she going to do? Kim will try to get a job at the corner store, being a cashier, but they're not going to hire her because she's so ditzy and dumb, she can't even count. She don't even know her own social security number to get a job to fill out the paperwork. She's not even going to be able to flip burgers at the local shake and bake or <laughs> the local taco stand or nothing. This chick is not, she's going to have nobody to rely on but herself. She's not going to be receiving any child support because Kanye is going to done taking her behind to the courts and shown what a horrible, horrific person this is for a mom. And she's going to lose her mind and some point get put in the loony town. Yes, she's going to be in a straight jacket at some point and become the crazy cat woman when she gets out. <laughs> now, Kim Kardashian, she's going to try to flip burgers. She's going to try to persuade the, own, you know, the owner and the manager to give her a job <laughs> and when he refuses, she's going to go outside and start yelling and screaming. She's going to have a super size diet soda in one hand, flipping the manager of the establishment, the bird, in the other hand. So Kim's not going to be too thrilled with her life at this point. She's not even going to be able to afford to go to the local Walmart and go shopping for clothes. She's not even, the clothes at the local Walmart ain't going to fit her. Kim's going to have to resort to shopping at the local, like, Salvation Army, the local Goodwill. The only thing she's going to be able to buy at the Walmart is her ho-ho cakes, you know, them fat girl cakes, because at this point she has put on a lot of extra pounds from the eating the big welfare cheese blocks and the food stamps that the state has given her. Now, she's either living in the local project houses, you know, based off her income, which she has none, because she went dead broke and her whole family just owned her big old butt. 
But no, not Kim. She thinks she's too high class for the local project houses. So she goes and gets herself a single wide mobile home. Now, she, at this point, Kim Kardashian is not even of high class to be living in the mobile home trailer uh, houses. This chick thinks she's the queen of the trailer park, y'all. Yes. And you guys ask, who is she dating? Who is all these men? Where's all these guys at? Well, let me tell y'all. Even the ugliest of guys. Yeah, y'all see Gargamel up there. Even these guys don't want her behind. She's um, been the doorknob to so many guys. You know, she had the rotating door outside her bedroom in Calabasas. The only kind of guy she's going to end up with is this guy right here that y'all see. Yeah, we're going to call him Stan. Now, her and Stan are living in the trailer park together. She done moved her new man, her new boo, into her trailer park home. And her and Stan want to try to make some new friends. So, who do they try to become friends with? Yes, Mama June. Yes, June Bug and her boo, her ex, now ex, one of her ex-husbands, yes. She going to try to befriend June. <laughs> Honey, boo-boo child. Well, June Bug is going to be like, Kim, you want to be friends with me, Memoir? I don't think so, girl. Honey, child, get out of here. I am too high class for you. Girl, you are so trashy, and I am classy. I can't be seen with a friend like you, girl. Get out of here. Meanwhile, Kanye and his wife, you know, they getting the last laugh, y'all. His wife, Bianca, done had him two singletons and a set of twin boys for this man. Yes, y'all heard that. And they got a puppy. <laughs> so, you know, Kanye is living his best life because he done sold his Yeezy brand for like trillions of dollars. And so he's living like a king. So y'all ask what happened to Momager Chris Jenner and the rest of the clan. Well, you know how they call the grandmother of the, you know, Chris Jenner, her mom, MJ. Well, rumor has it is that Chris Jenner's face now looks identical to MJ, no other than Michael Jackson himself. Yes. So now they just call MJ instead of MJ the grandmother. They just call her grandma. Now, Chris Jenner, Pimpager, Momager, whatever you want to call her. She told Kim, she said, girl, you got to get your money up, girl, or I'm going to put you out. She is still, you know, living the highfalutin self that she is. She's still living the highfalutin life that she's always dreamt of. And the rest of the girls, they're still, you know, selling their self to the devil. Chris just felt like she couldn't, you know, sell out Kim anymore because she was already dried up and nobody wanted that dirty old thing no more. So Chris set her sights on the next generation of the Kardashian clan. And as for Rob, woo, y'all. Rumor has it that he is still MIA and Kris Jenner made him join the circus, y'all. Yes, he is right along side by side with Coco the Clown, y'all. Now, if y'all enjoyed this video and want to hear other ones and watch other ones kind of like this, hit that like button and make sure y'all definitely subscribe. And let me know down in the comments what y'all thought of this video, and I will talk to y'all later. <laughs> Bye.